Hey, this is Keith at Custom Work. As promised, we're gonna show you what we got done today. Um, last video, we showed you our uh, coilover conversion and our tubular control arms. Uh, what we got here is our C5 brake kit. Uh, those are EVC rotors. They're dimpled, not drilled, which is pretty cool because they won't crack. Um, these are also the uh, Camaro 98-2002 to 2002. The LS style uh, calipers. They're really similar to the C5 ones, but uh, they're a little bit cheaper and they actually have bigger pistons in them. And uh, we like them because they don't say Corvette on them, but we make a kit that actually use either the Corvette or the uh, Camaro calipers. Um, got our front sway bar installed as well. Um, we went in and got the body bushings in this thing. Let's see if we can get a Good picture. There's our solid body bushings there. Got another one here at the back. We also got our rear sway bar uh, installed. It is our Pro Touring clamp-on style. Again, we showed you our rear big brake kit. Um, here's the sway bar from the back. Clamps on to the rear axle housing. This, this setup is kind of nice because it, uh, most of the early cars don't have sway bar factory brackets and uh, this one actually you don't need them. So um, it also gives you a lot more room to run exhaust on the car um, over here because you don't have those down bars hanging. Um, I don't know if you can see that side better or this side better, but anyways, you got brackets that we weld into the frame. You can bolt them in too. Um, we use Heim joint end links on them. Works out really good. Got shaft collars on the sway bar so it doesn't move side to side. Anyways, uh, Here's another view of the solid body bushings in place. Uh, tomorrow we'll probably put subframe connectors in it and get things wrapped up. Anyways, we appreciate it and uh, we'll have some more videos probably for you tomorrow.